What is up, you guys? This is your boy Andy Matrix. I talk about anime, manga, video games, geek culture, and Japanese culture. So my video on why anime is better than American cartoons became pretty popular. However, there have been some people that misunderstood what I said about the video. Uh, if you look at the comment section, it seems that some people thought I was either ignoring or disregarding the top animated shows made in America, such as Invincible, Avatar The Last Airbender, and Arcane. This video is part two of that video in response to all the comments, okay? What I'd like to say is that I stand by what I said about anime being better than American cartoons. I know that over the past few years, some really good shows have been made, such as Invincible, right? However, anime still overshadows those few good animated shows. Of course, everyone has their preference. You know, there are people that hate anime and prefer American cartoons like Steven Universe and Gravity Falls. Okay, I'm not going, I'm going to explain again why anime is still better than American cartoons, despite of the fact that we have seen a few good shows like Arcane and Invincible uh, in the last few years. I want to start by saying this, okay? We are not going to see animated movies and shows like Disney used to make. Movies like Treasure Planet, Aladdin, Anastasia, Atlantis The Lost Empire. You want to know why? Because Disney does not care about 2D animation anymore. They don't value it. It's all about 3D animation now, baby. We are not going to see animated movies like Fire and Ice, directed by Rolf Bakshi, anymore because the West does not value animation like they used to. Those days are over, and guess what? Disney is investing into anime. Yeah, Disney is investing into anime. Look it up. I have many videos on that too. Disney the Animation Empire now wants to make their own anime in Japan and bring it to the West. Toonami is making their own anime. Look it up. I've made videos on that too. Netflix has been producing anime for a while now, and they keep producing more anime because they know it brings more subscribers. Japan is the new king of anime, and many animation studios are being overworked because the demand is exhausting. For every high-quality American cartoon like Avatar The Last Airbender, there are 20 to 30 high-quality anime, and that is not an exaggeration. America is still making cartoons, but very few are at the same quality of Avatar The Last Airbender or Invincible. Those two shows are the exception, not the rule. America makes low-quality, cheap animation, usually aimed at kids. And although adult animation like some of what Netflix produces, like BoJack Horseman, Disenchantment, Paradise PD, F is for Family, Inside Job, they are not drawn with real human anatomy like most anime are. TV shows like Gravity Falls and Steven Universe are easier to animate and, f and finish compared to, to something like Food Wars, right? You know, they're much cheaper. They're faster to make and cheaper, right? And this is why anime will always be better than American cartoons because the effort put into anime is what the Western animation companies have lost. Some people talk trash about the movie Titan AE, but despite of what people said about the movie, the animation is so much better than most cartoon shows that you see on Cartoon Network. Okay? Another problem with American cartoons that I talked about in, 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 the, in the original video of why anime is better than American cartoons video is that most American cartoons focus on comedy. Which is great, don't get me wrong. American comedy, you know, is good. I love American comedy. However, one of the reasons why anime destroys cartoons every single time is because of the deep storytelling, uh, you know, time after time, title after title. Take a look at Attack on Titan. Take a look at Demon Slayer, right? And if you want to talk about comedy, take a look at an old anime like Excel Saga. Not only is it funny, but it's also, you know, it also looks better, you know, as far as art. The comedy might be better with American cartoon shows, but that is all they have. This is Andy Matrix, guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure to comment below. Tell me what you think. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. And I'll see you guys in the next video. This is Andy Matrix. Godspeed.